sponsored by your Oklahoma Ford New Orleans was super high on just being able to work on... Well, okay. <laughs> Let me read <rephrase> this. <laughs> wow. This guy. He was super Coming high on home. working with you. Oh, the big Kiwi Stephen Adams keeping the mood light at Thunder Media Day 2018. And welcome into sports, everybody. Training camp begins tomorrow for the first time since Kevin Durant left the team high and dry. The Thunder's long-term future is stable. As Jacob Toby tells us, the question surrounding this team no longer about who will be here and who won't. The focus now simply progress. Thanks, Kate. And a lot of good stuff today at the Thunder's Media Day. Had Paul George talking about re-signing with the team. Steven Adams, of course, was being Steven Adams. And there was a whole new sense of change within this organization. Just really, I think, focusing on how we can be more consistent. Um, that certainly was a challenge, I think, for us last year. Change can be the word used to describe the new-look OKC Thunder. The obvious change? No Carmelo Anthony, and Paul George is now in it for the long haul. The city being behind this team, um, the team being behind the community, it, it was just hand in hand. And then just being a part of this team, it, it just felt it felt right. Just creating a relationship, knowing a little bit more about him, his family, um, you know, his goals, uh, what he what he want to do, um, and he just clicked from there. Another change would be the addition of new play-by-play -play man Chris Fisher after the dismissal of Brian Davis. Then there's the bevy of new players added to the roster, headlined by Dennis Schroeder. Up over Gobert and he hits it. And obviously, Dennis is a great player. Um, done a lot of great things in Atlanta. Um, plays fast, plays with pace. Training camp starts tomorrow, which should be interesting to see how Billy Donovan will mold this new team, led by Russell Westbrook and Paul George. In Oklahoma City, Jacob Toby, two works for you.